All right, we are here to set a new world record for No Man's Sky, normal mode, start to the space station. According to speedrun.net, the current record is 7 minutes and 10 seconds. Let's see what we can do. All right, let's do it again. I mean, for the first time. This is totally the first time I tried. Three, two, one. Okay, frozen's not bad. I got carbon, I got ferrite dust. Let's see which way I'm facing. Perfect. I swear waiting this first minute is the hardest part. Here we go. Do this. Feeling good. So far, so good. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Don't screw up now. Come on, there we go. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Come on. Uh, let's take it forever. Let's go! Come on, be close, be close. Don't be a pill. Okay, I can do that. I can do this. Feeling good. Wish the game would move faster.
pill sucks. Go, go, go. Get in the hole! Jesus. Let's go, let's go. We can do this. We're gonna do it. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Alright! Now when the other guy does it, uh, they kill themselves to get back to their ship. But I had a different idea. Freak out, Bob, like last time. Let's just get in the hole, do it properly. Nothing premature. Like that spin move at the end, and then when I jump out and touch the ground, the time will stop and not before. There we did it, 643.52. A new world record. Suck it, Jason. <laughs> See how long that stands. I'm sure everybody's gonna be out there doing it. I'm gonna put links in the description below. Uh, so here's the deal, uh, speedrun.com. Let me show you what the rules say before everybody freaks out on me. Um, and then I will show you exactly how I did this, what I did to make this possible, and what you can do if you want to give it a shot. All right, so here we are on speedrun.com, and I wanted to show you this real quick. You type in a search for No Man's Sky, and you're going to get the list here. Uh, the first one is what we did, which was a race to the space station on normal mode. Uh, Skillac had it for a couple days. Bro, I'm sorry. But uh, check out his video. I actually learned some of the techniques by watching him. Uh, so check his video out on YouTube. Uh, good job, man. Let's take a look at the rules because people are gonna. I'm sure you guys are saying that's not fair. You cheated. So let's look at let's let's look at the rules. Uh, category rules: Reach the space station. Period. Time stops when you exit your at the space station. Period. Hmm, that, that's not hard. Okay, we did that. Game rules: Runs must begin on a new save. Check. Time starts when you press the button to initialize, check. Uh, the creation of a new save must be present in your video, check. A timer must be present in your video, we recommend live split, check, check. I used live split, downloaded it and figured it out. All times are measured in RTA, which is real time attack, actual time with loads continuing non-stop from start to finish, check. You'll see that in the video. Submissions with times measured in IGT and game time uh, will be rejected. So, save editors banned, I didn't use that. Your game must be unmodded. All mods, regardless of purpose, are banned. It's unmodded. Runs must be played in single player mode, check. We strongly recommend disabling multiplayer in the options. Uh, note that this can be done before your run on another save. So, this, uh, this is what I exploited if you want to use them if you want to use a word for it um, if you receive any items from another player you must immediately discard them using items received from another player will invalidate your run so uh, they're recommending that you go into another save and prepare yourself for this save by disabling multiplayer okay you can do that in the save that you're doing the run on it's quicker if you do it in another save so you don't have to mess with it when you start your your timed speed run so what I did was I went into another save and I got out of multiplayer, uh, went to uh, went to a space station, flew right outside that space station, called the anomaly in. Then I teleported down to a planet from the anomaly and quit. I started a new game 
And when you do that, you're gonna have the ability to return directly to the anomaly as long as you don't take off in a ship from the planet. If you return directly to the anomaly as soon as you launch in, your ship's broken and you can't do anything about it. However, if you get all the components to fix your ship, like I learned from watching these guys, and then jump back to the anomaly, you're good to go, which is what I showed you here. Now, uh, this may be the new meta for how to do this, and people will beat this time here uh, by the end of this video, uh, or it, because uh, I didn't have the best technique and I missed some stuff. Uh, I was a little nervous. I've, I haven't done it a ton of times, but uh, I had my moment. I'm happy with that. I don't need the world record forever, assuming that is they validate my submission of this video. Let me know what you think. You think I cheated? I don't think I cheated. Game rules are here. I think I'm good. Category rules? I think I'm good. Uh, there's some other categories here we can play with as well. Guys, check this out. I'd love to see more um, people jumping in and paying attention to this on No Man's Sky. Uh, Artemis Path, only one dude has done it. Three hours and 56 minutes. I feel like maybe we can make a run at that. Now, it has permadeath and creative. Honestly, I don't see why creative is in here. But that's just me. I'm not judging if that's what you want to do. If you can get the world record in creative, good for you. Atlas Path, no one has even done this yet on normal uh, or permadeath. So come here and do it. Galaxy Center, normal and perma. Uh, Galaxy Center without using portals on normal and perma. Nobody has tried this. And then there's some funny miscellaneous ones. Die in a volcano. I actually, uh, I, I watched this uh, rehab guy do it. Uh, it was mighty funny. He was trying to get the speed run to, I think, the station. He spawned in and there was a volcano right in front of him. And he goes, we're going for it. And he jumped in one minute, 38 seconds, died in a volcano. Now, I feel like Bob needs that. Uh, and if I jump in front of a volcano while I happen to be timing, uh, you'll, you'll bet your bottom dollar Bob is going, going for it. So uh, the other miscellaneous is the end of the line, which is if you look at the rules for this, uh, time stops when you lock in the final warp uh, to the center of Loza, Lozangola. I guess that's the last uh, galaxy. So that's probably gonna take a while. There it is, speedrun.com. Check it out, guys. Links in the description below. Um, I'll, uh, any questions you have, let me know in the comments. Full disclosure, I learned this method from Captain Steve, who I believe learned it from Scottish Rob. They both have great YouTube channels you should check out. Hey, Speedrun, if you want to change the rules, feel free. I, I get it, um, but I followed the rules. The rules said nothing about this for a moment in time. I want the record. And then, and then somebody else will take it. That's fine. No cheating but change the rules. I'm all good with that. All right. Uh, so guys, I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, let me know down below in the comments, hit that like button. It really does help me. If you hit the like button, let me know. What do you think about these speed runs? There's some cool ones on here. I'd love to see some more categories and some more attention paid to no man's sky for this. Cause it's fun. It is a lot of fun. Uh, guys, I hope you enjoyed this. And, uh, yeah, if you're going to be a Bob, figure out how to win without breaking the rules. No cheaty cheaty. <laughs> Guys, we'll see you next time. Uh, hope you enjoyed it. All these guys, they're coming to see me. They want my autograph. Hey, buddy, that's okay. You want my autograph? No? Yeah? Maybe? Not really? All right, whatever. See you next time, guys.